Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Naya Slivers. We're up against Lucas over here, Boshi. We won the die roll. And we have a keepable hand. Double Sentinel isn't, like, the world's best because they don't stack. But, you know what? They're, they're good boys. They're good beefy boys. We'll take it. Go turn one Sidewinder. Well, let's go. We'll see what Lucas is on about. I'm passing, Lucas. I'm passing. Oh, boy. Oh. Goblins? Okay. I can run with some goblins. This first strike will be pretty handy, I feel like. Uh, if we can get it down. Another Sidewinder. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I think I'm going to go Sentinel here. Uh, I will offer the trade. They are going to take it. Sounds good. Depending on what we can get here. Oh, they just had another one. No wonder. And Denizen. Not fun. But first strike, again, will be really handy against him. We just need to get it down. I think I'll go muscle here so I can attack in. No blocks. Take three, Lucas. Plenty of mana for you over there. Burning tree, all right. I'm going to start popping off a little bit, I think. Bushwhacker kicked. Not fun. Swinging out. I'll just block here. They got two cards in hand, so I'll take a good chunk. We'll get rid of their. Bushwhacker. All right. Sorry, I have a little cough. Well, Sentinel's coming in quite handy in this matchup and giving us some defense and being able to attack in still is really nice. I think I, depending on what they do here, I may trade something for the Denizen, but uh, they drew a land. I don't think they've got much going on now at this point. We'll see, though. Lucas, 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 what do you got for me? Goblin Grenade. Well, he's not going to be happy to see we have another one floating over here in our hand. 
the most inconvenient, convenient hand ever with the double sentinel. I take back everything I said. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yep, we just put down sentinel again. Look at that. What you think about this? Your worst enemy. Make some concede. Sentinel conceding. All right. Um, prismatic. Swift. For like an overpowered denizen or something like that. Uh, we'll take out winding. I like striking in this. Take out one gem hide. Uh, we could... Mm, I don't really want to cut Fiverlance. We could cut one Fiverlance. Hunter? Is Hunter necessary? I think Heart and Striking are better here. Let's see. Well, this is a bit awkward. I'm not uh, exactly thrilled about this. Uh, do we keep? We'll try it. It's a bit awkward though. Everything is right now. Call red and pass. Gonna take a few good hits, though, I think. All these two twos are no joke. awkward spot. Do I want to play Predatory? No matter what, we're getting hit for a good amount next turn. Do I want to play my Predatory into anything? That's the question. I kind of want to be mana efficient here and just put it down. I don't, I don't really like just playing a Sidewinder or Plated and then passing. Let's at least use our mana a little bit better. Bushwhacker sucks. Really sucks. <sighs> Taking 11? Holy cow, man. Not 11. Wait, is it 11? Yeah, it's 11. Go to seven. I don't like it. Swift response. That will be nice, but do we want to play it? Oh, it's tough, man. I think we just got to get some creatures down. And prep for blocking. Hopefully they don't have another bushwhacker. Four cards in hand though. Goblin grenade is uh, gonna hurt. Denizen. 
Not really worried about it this turn, although we may have to start holding up a swift response for him. That's unfortunate. I don't like that. Take six, go to one. <laughs> I don't know what else we can do here, man. I'm going to take six, go to one. So another predatory helps us survive. I think we just have to go predatory pass with swift response up for denizen hope they don't have another form of removal for our predatory i think that's our best bet i mean they they there's a lot they can have here that'll just kill us but what else can we do let's see what they got Bushwhacker kicked is the worst thing we could see. Or just a lightning bolt to the face or something like that. Oh, that's... Uh, that's... Uh, that's that's going to do it. That's going to do it. Can't beat that. Yep, alright. We're not going to show them swift response. We're just going to go to the next game. Uh, let's run it back yeah let's run it back we're just a little bit behind on that one I will play first give me a good hand uh, this is an awkward hand but uh, sure I'll keep it We're just going to get our stuff down, worry about the Thriving Grove and Ash Barons later. Conscripts, sure, sure. Another planes, that's not ideal. Just pass. This is going to be bad. This is going to be real bad. That's really bad. Well, we can outpace it for a minute. We got a Viverlint, huh? Go ahead and grab our mountain really quick. We don't exactly need it. Let's just take care of it. Mm, now nah, we're just going to pass. Sparksmith is going to be not good if they pop off this turn. Or they could kill a lord. Now they can just 
kill anything. Tough matchup. They have so many tools. Another Sparksmith. Oh, they got a good hand against us, that's for sure. Plated. Not really what we're looking for. I can just kill everything. This sucks. I need, uh... I need my hunter. I took out, didn't I? Did I take out hunter in this matchup? Yeah. Well, everything's gonna die very soon. There's not much I can do about it because we're just going to keep playing goblins. Expecting a bushwhacker here or something. Like they just go bushwhacker now and swing for an absorbent amount of uh, damage. Casting with Dash. Swinging in with Sparksmith. I don't know why they're doing that. On select doesn't really matter. Yeah, it does really. Okay. I'm just gonna double block it just in case. He gets returned. Winding way, you gotta save me, buddy. That's tough. Maybe we could have gotten somewhere. We would have had to got. We would have had to really get lucky on that winding way to get uh, past their smart sparksmith. Yep. And another sparksmith. That's lovely. And then the dash. Well, they're empty-handed now. I think we just killed Goblin Heel Cutter. Sure, that's fine. All right, we need another really good refill here. Let's 
kill you. Take six. It's our best shot. That's not refill. That's unfortunate. Uh, let's see. Is this uh, lethal? Double Sparksmith. Kill, kill. Take four. Oh, we're not dead, but we basically are dead. Whoa. Just hit my mic. My bad, guys. Uh, yeah, we're basically dead. We're going to go to one this turn. And we're going to lose our whole board. We could just die, depending on their top deck, too. Move to the attack step, huh? Swing out here just tells me they have... What are they doing? Why did they just pass the turn? I really don't know why they passed the turn. Could have done this last turn and had me at one life. So I'm confused. I guess they're just setting up for the win this way. Kill one more of my creatures and swing out. Block, block. We take four. We still go to one. Yeah, the. Confusing. I don't know why they're delaying the inevitable here. They go to two life, though. <laughs> Well, if they mess this up, they actually could mess this up and sparksmith themselves to death if they do this wrong. That would be funny. Maybe they won't notice. That's stupid. That's stupid. You gotta be kidding me. Ah, oh, come on. Stupid goblin grenade, man. Ah, uh, we could have won one more turn. Could have won one more turn. Got it striking. Yeah, well, our, our draws were kind of crap for the next few turns anyways, but... Uh, yeah, they brought themselves to two with the Smarks, Sparksmiths, which was crazy. But, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. It was a fun matchup. It's a tough one, too. Goblins is tough. Uh, but leave a like if you enjoyed. Leave a comment down below. And make sure you stay tuned for more Nia Slivers coming up in the rest of the week here. And we will see you guys in the next video.